Since we have seen the asynchronous programming implementation using the callback and the event emitter. The problem is you have seen like whenever I am writing a code and if there is any error we are just throwing that error but we are not handling that. So in this video we will see how we can handle the errors in the asynchronous programming. In the traditional programming we use the try catch finally blocks but in the asynchronous they are not going to work. So let's see a basic way how we can make the error handling thing in asynchronous programming of Node.js. So as you have seen so far whenever we are writing the asynchronous programming using the callback functions we are throwing the error whenever it is occurring all right like if error through error if error through error so we are just throwing it without handling that all right so let's see if such situation arises like we have some error how can we handle that in asynchronous programming all right so in this particular program what we will do is we will uh, read start reading the file again as we have a file called data.txt so far with us all right which we were reading so far okay and in case we got the data we will print that but in case if we got any exception or any error we have another thing called process.on where uncaught exception will be treated like an event all right as so far you have seen like we have used this on method on method for uh, handling the event making the event listener all right so this uh, uncaught exception is going to be an event for us and we need to listen to that all right and it will be all be done running on the current process of your node js so if i will run this program let's see here since we have this file the data is being read but now if i will change the name of this file or do anything all right now this dad.txt doesn't exist in my location so if i will execute it again you will see the exception was caught all right means the same message which we have printed here so this is one of the way of handling the error in node.js asynchronous programming for error handling we have one more option that is including a domain module in your application so let's find the error handling through the domain now here the another way to handle the exception is inclusion of domain as here you can see I have created a domain which I have put in the variable called domain and whatever will take place inside this domain will have to bind it inside the run function so here in domain.run you can see there is a callback function which is doing all the regular tasks which we have been doing so far alright and if anywhere inside this domain.run if there is any error caught that will be handled by here in this error event like domain.on is error alright so here I'm reading the same file data.txt alright so if I'm successfully done with the reading of this file I can get the data so let's see how can I do that so it's simply like node app.js and here I'm successfully able to run the uh, program right but now if this particular file which I am looking for like daa.txt it is not there in my directory alright so if I will rerun this program you see the exception was caught right because there is a no file found exception so that error is being taken care by this domain.on so this is how you can handle the error in the asynchronous programming whenever you work in the node.js